And here's JT looking. First, JT, first down. Jonathan Taylor rolling. Touchdown. That's what you want out of your best players. You want them to show up when it matters most. And that's what Jonathan Taylor does consistently. Wisconsin made a lot of big plays throughout this game. Uh, but I believe this play that we're gonna look at and dive into was a huge momentum shift and big play for them at this point in the game, especially when you're at home and you got a team like Michigan on the ropes. All right, so I wanna draw this play up for you guys because this was a big time play. Really gave Wisconsin a lot of momentum. And so what we have is trips left. I'm gonna draw up the line first. We got center, guard, tackle, and tight end. Left guard, left tackle, wide receiver, another wide receiver on the ball, and another wide receiver all the way out wide. Jack Cohn is in what we call pistol formation, and so Jonathan Taylor is right behind him. So the defense has nose tackle and Another defensive end on the outside with the safety impressed man coverage over Wisconsin's receiver number three. So we got three linebackers on the back end and the safety, strong safety, all the way at the top. So as number three goes in motion, the receiver, what it does is it forces the safeties to rotate. So this safety has to rotate all the way back to the top position, middle of the field, and the strong safety has to rotate down just in case Wisconsin does actually run a jet sweep. I believe if that jet sweep motion does not happen, that safety is in perfect position to tackle Jonathan Taylor. And so by the time number 24 realizes what's happening, it's too late. Jonathan Taylor has one of the things that you can't teach, speed. And so this run is actually designed to go up in the middle of the defense. But Jonathan Taylor, again, with his vision, he does a great job at being patient. We have a saying, it's speed through the hole, not to the hole. It's so important because you need patience. If he takes that ball full speed, he doesn't make that cut and he misses that big hole that opens up on the outside. He allows the blocks to develop, allows his offensive linemen to get on those linebackers, the defensive ends. And so what makes this a big play for Wisconsin is the defensive end. He kind of jumps inside too early. He's not patient enough. And again, once that receiver goes in motion, that defensive end has to understand, I'm the last guy of containment on this line. And so I think possibly he still thinks the safety either has outside containment or he's just too fast, he's too aggressive. If you're too fast, you're too aggressive, it usually results in negative plays, which was a huge play for Wisconsin. Look at his receivers running down the field to celebrate with him. He shows up in the big time, in the big time games. Look at his offensive lineman running down the field, pumping up the crowd. You see his quarterback, Jack Cohn, celebrating with him in the end zone. That's what you want to see. Look at all those guys in the end zone celebrating. That's important, man. You can tell they are excited to block for Jonathan Taylor. 